Um, in my video where Kaylee played soccer and she got these cuts and band-aids on her knees, um, I had a poll about um, if I should make a video on how I made her band-aids and pretty much everyone said yes. So we are going to teach you how to do that today. And it's super easy, super cute, very customizable. Let's get started. Materials you need is just a piece of white paper, some scissors, some tape, and markers. Okay, so what you want to do is like, I'm going to make one for Emma. I know I said that all the babies made them, but I they didn't actually make them all. I just said that because like, I don't know, it just seemed cool. So this is Emma's favorite color. You can just take a color and just draw this like, oval shape that one's really long <laughs> and then so that's gonna be the basic shape of a band-aid you can just use a plain old color like if you want to like this is usually band-aid color you can just make it like a plain old band-aid but just make it on this so you don't actually have to use real band-aids but yeah so you want to do that and um then you want to draw a design like emma likes cats so i'm gonna do like a little orange cat and then you can literally put anything on it. You can make your, you can have your babies do it themselves. That was a voice crack. Um, yeah, you can just like, it's very, very, very customizable. Wait, this is not the color I wanted. Where is it? <laughs> I hate when I can't find the color. It's this one. Okay. I want to draw some hearts so it's very similar to Kaylee's. Their favorite animal in the middle. I just do like their favorite color and their favorite animal because it's things they like. So it's just very customizable. You can do anything to it. You can do a pattern. This will not actually heal. So if you're trying to do this for yourself, sure it'll look decorative and cute, but it won't actually heal you or like protect you very well. So once you have your little pattern drawn, you want to take your fabulous scissors. I have these safety scissors because you've got to be safe. And now I'm just cutting out what I drew. And this is as simple as it seems. Like, literally I'm just making a bandaid out of paper. That's really all I did. But I pretended we got a, for role play, I pretended we got a bandaid making kit. And yeah, so. If you wanted to be really realistic, you could like get a, a brown box, like tape over it with white paper and like, like put pa white paper over it or like paint it and then decorate it to be like, Bandy decorating kit and then make a bunch of these little things but like have it just white and then come with like a few markers and some tape and, and that'd be funny like yeah so this is a little Emma's band-aid now if you want to learn how to apply it it's very simple you take your doll I'm gonna pretend she got a cut right here on her arm so you want to take your tape and make it longer than the band-aid right here this is my tape and then I'm just Putting it over the band-aid, mine, oh no, I missed. I missed you guys. Here, I'm gonna do this again, cause that ruins the tape. <laughs> I missed, like, you wanna cover the whole thing so it looks shiny and protective like a real band-aid is. So, let's try this again, but not miss. There we go. See how it's covering the whole top and the whole bottom and then there's extra on the sides? That's your adhesive part, so you just put it where you want it and then adhere it down and you can see that. But now she has a band-aid and it's really cute. You can make anything you want on these band-aids. You can make them bigger, like if you want them to have like a big band-aid, if you want them to have a small, like one of those little circle ones, like if they get a shot, just make a small one. You can make them any size, any shape, any color. Like you can make heart band-aids. I know Emma would love that, I bet cat shaped band is what she'd really like so you can just really make them anything and it's just super fun and cute and i really like them anyways guys that is how i made the band-aids i just think that's a cute fun creative way um it can get your babies involved into like making them feel better and like you don't have to waste your real band-aids it's just these are simple like materials that like most people have at home so yeah you can use crayons and stuff too if you want. I just use markers because I think the colors come out better. But yeah, so I'm just trying to show you like with the band-aids <laughs> rather than their faces. So anyways guys, thanks for watching. Please click like and subscribe and in the comments, let me know if you think this is a cute way to make band-aids for the babies. I think it is. I'll see you guys later. Bye.